Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration Reading for all Capricorn, Sun, Moon and Rising. I want to say thank you for being here, thank you for being back. Please like, share these videos and thumbs up. This is going to be a week of a lot of transformation. It is the fourth week of the year 2017. It is the 25th week and the week beginning from the 19th until the 25th. So this is really something messages is coming in and victory and success so i have on the left hand messages coming in to you guys and i have victory and success the ace of swords on the other hand so this is going to be good it's all about uh, new things the messages good things coming in wonderful energies wonderful things it's connecting with business but it's all about the lovers because we start the week uh, with um the energy of inner strength looking for inner strength and the zodiac energy is going to be hair until tuesday it changes to water so it's a transformation for you capricorns in this week which is going to be just so positive just very wonderful it's all about love love and it's true love true love is coming in whatever and whoever you're connecting with at this time whoever is your partner it's the correct person and that is true love is a love a universal love that is coming in this is very positive there is going to be a um, message of money coming into you um, a lot of message of money coming into you um, you also have the energy vibration of the ace of Pentacles so it's going to be a lot of money so here we go on Monday we have the energy vibration of the two of cups this two of cups is um, cups in is, is, is a situation in business good messages or coming in with connection or um, a, a, to work together with other people which is going to be bringing you a wonderful a lot of money um, this is a positive energies in business and it's a positive energies in love because you have the energy vibration of the ace of Pentacles that means a lot of money and you are having a message that a lot of money is coming to you and your business or partners and that sort of a thing so this is good as we look forward we have the five of cups and the five of cups is that you are having a situation in your life that you've been looking back but it's okay because you are not really um, worried about that you're just looking back at certain things and then you look forward so this is really good so this is a positive energy so as again I said the eight number 88 is your energy vibration in this week as we look in the middle of the week we have temperance so we need to have a little balance on Wednesday it's going to be temperance so whatever is happening it's like on Wednesday something is going to happen that you have to have really a balance in your life you have to find the inner you have to bring temperance you have to bring balance to certain things in your life in love and in money so and in work so um, you're going to the energy vibration for you guys is going to be temperance in this week there's something that is happening the angels are coming in and say just just you know be balanced be balanced have balance find balance find balance whatever is happening just find balance in this week on Thursday we have the eight of ones and eight of ones is a good sign with business and information over business for a lot of people the eight of ones is good is good sign to people who are trying to find financial help and that sort of it or help good information is going to come in but it's all about information over money and it is a good thing because some people somehow money is going to come to you money is coming to you and especially for the um the men this is going to be a good thursday is going to be a good day because you're going to get get the message about money coming into you and uh, your business is like it's going to have a high generation of incomes on thursday on Friday we had the energy vibration of uh, the lovers and this is wonderful and the lovers we had the ace of cups oh wow this is beauty this is beauty this is love from the universe coming to um, both you two or or expressing love and this is a profound powerful love that is coming in your life this is a positive positive this is good love this is the correct love this is the, the right person for you this is so positive on Friday so if you guys are going out and you met someone you're going to fall in love okay honestly 
you're going to fall in love with whoever you meet on Friday you're going to fall in love so let's say that you have been looking for someone for a long time and you have given up because you're going to meet that person on Friday and it's going to be a love a soul connection um, a twin flame connection so this is going to be positive for you guys uh, Saturday you'll be working Saturday you're working hard and by working hard um, the universal angels are coming in and helping you and by working hard they're going to help you to manifest more abundancy in your life more of your materialist uh, things is going to come in your life which is so positive this is a very very positive uh, effect on you and this is going to be good so you know hold on because whatsoever is happening is going to come on Sunday you have the Queen of Swords and whosoever this person is keep away from this person the energy do not use the energy of the Queen of Swords you know don't go so dwarfs at people it's not really good don't go so you know with the harsh words of people it's not really good just leave it have balance have balance because uh, the energy and this is uh, the energy temperance have temperance with this person no matter whoever this person is because it's someone that is going to affect you have balance temperance with this person she doesn't deserve your energy to give out that sort of energy okay so again it's all about balance on Sunday whoever this person is just don't you know let this person just you know there's sometimes that you need to stand above people and sometimes when people give off some certain things and wants to say certain things and you know behave a certain way, so you let them go let them go because uh, you know words or wind but blow is unkind my grandmother always say that to me she says words or wind but blow is unkind when someone hits you that is when you should react and take action so let people talk about whoever and say whatever they want to say because uh, they cannot affect who you are as a person and each and every one of us and people should have respect for other people the energy of love is wonderful and powerful love is uh, uh, the most foremost the duality of tools you guys are working with dualities of tools messages is coming in victory and success against this king of swords have patience with this person you know balance out everything because the energy of duality is so here in on Monday you have the two of cups on the Wednesday you have also a two of cups which the angels are trying to show you to bring balance in your life on Friday the lovers are here so this is just wonderful profound good energies and good situations that are coming in your life so this is extremely positive as we ask Archangel Michael, what should the Capricorns know for the week beginning at 19 until the 25? What did the Capricorns know? You have created the situation. Okay. So, whosoever have created the situation, the Capricorn said you have created the situation. Whoever, whoever has created the situation, create a situation in their life. Ask Archangel Michael to redo it and heal the situation so you can move forward. There should be another message, Archangel Michael. What message would you like to come out for the Capricorns? Have self respect. Okay. So, alrighty. Okay, okay. Okay, there's a team going on here, Archangel Michael. What is happening? You create the situation and you have the power to change it. Thank you for letting me learn and lean on you and the strength and remember me of my personal power. Please guide me to manifest and heal accordingly to divine will creating peace and blessings for everyone involved okay so whosoever have created a situation in their life just call upon Archangel Michael thank you for letting me learn on lean on your strength and for reminding me of uh, personal powers please guide me to manifest and heal accordingly to the divine will creating peace and blessing in my life and the other thing that you have is self-respect this is very strange, but not very strange because I think it have to do with the Queen of Pentacles, the self-respect when it comes up. 
and it says dear God and angel thank you for helping me see myself as you see me through the eyes of love thank you for honoring and respecting me please give me guidance to do um, the same for myself and others and grant me the courage to speak up on my own behalf I ask for your protection in all of my relationships so that I am surrounded by loving and kind people so whatsoever is happening it has to do with this queen of sword the queen of sword and the queen of sword could be for some people their um um their mother their kids their their mother or a sister or that sort of a thing and whosoever she is she's blazing her fire let her blaze because whenever people like these blaze uh, have some self-respect for yourself uh, you know and by having self-respect for yourself you know you are going to manage the situation whatever situation that is going on for you Capricorns this is just wonderful because you have the ace of cups and the ace of um, Pentacles and this is good this is good energies for you guys so I'm asking the angels for whatever question the Capricorns have out there what is the message that you you would like to give the Capricorns in this week and it's going to be wait okay okay you Capricorns reconsider wait and reconsider you Capricorns get more information okay there are situations that happening in your you Capricorn's life because the first one for some people wait we're not aware of whatever you're planning on doing but they're saying wait but the energy of the sword is as if you guys want to cut through and go forward and they're saying wait okay for the ones who want to cut through and go forward and you're feeling better because you're no longer in that sense of the hangman in reverse you are just feeling that any wait okay wait and the next one is reconsider and reconsider meaning it's not that it's not a yes and it's not that it's not a no but all they're saying is to reconsider um, a decision that you're about to make okay and the next one we have get more information okay get more information so let's see what weight is saying because I want you guys to wait wait your situation is going is going to require a little patience your angels are not saying no but they're not saying yes as yet Sometimes heaven needs a little extra time to make all the pieces fall in places. What you are asking for may have an effect on your lives and others. It can also take additional preparation to make sure that everyone needs are seen. Be patient so that all who are involved can have the um, experience they need and meant for okay and the next one is reconsider and wait and reconsider I see as the uh, just about the, the same thing because waiting is wait till better conditions and reconsider there is an element of your plan that should be um, reevaluated take some times to really go through your project and proposal through share your intention with a trustworthy friend or advice we can give you your objective feedback ask your angels for guidance this is not the moment to make the changes in your life that you're considering a better time will come and you will realize that your wishes to choose a different thing or a kind of transformation will be there okay and get more information get more information so I'm seeing what the angels are saying because they want they don't want you to jump into something they really 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 wants you to reconsider look at things get more information before you're going to make an um, before you're going to make a move in your life whatever that is going to be the situation you are asking about requires more information in order for you to make a wise 
decision. Approach those knowledgeable about the topics to solicit their advice. If there are friends and family, if there are friends and family member in your midst who have insight into a matter, ask for their observation. You may need to do some analytic research in order to get the data you need. This could include reading books, taking classes, or a seminar, or getting information from the internet. And this is good. So, this is a wonderful, wonderful experience for you guys. So, be aware of what you do. And I want to say to you guys please listen to your sun, moon, and rising sign. Know that you're spiritually protected in this week. Whatever is happening, it's good. There's a lot of energy of money, balance, and transformation. Love. Um, Friday is a good day to go out and meet people on Monday money is going to come in to you business wise and positive so this is going to be a positive week please remember to listen to your sun moon and rising sun and I'm saying I have a wonderful week